All right, Shalom. First off, I want to give all praises and honor and glory to Yah Bashem Yahushah and double honors to the apostles of Great Millstone. And Shashir Shalom to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and sincerity. Um, I want to go in on a quick little topic. I'm not trying to make it all uh, long and drawn out. Uh, I'm going to start off with... Hold on, slide here. Yeah. Daniel 7 and uh, 25, it says, uh, and he shall speak great, great words against the most high. You know, uh, first off, you know, this is talking about um, Esau, you know, according to Genesis 25, the so-called uh, white man, you know, they don't keep any law, statutes or commandments that uh, in the Bible. And I'm doing this lesson to prove, you know, or show how um, they are uh, the devil, according to the Bible, you know. Um, the word devil just simply means deceiver. But uh, the so-called white man, um, they actually come from Esau, which is, uh, he got his name changed to Edom. Um, they're actually called Edomites, according to the Bible. That's their national, uh, that's, in, that's their nationality. But um, more specifically, this verse, it says, and he shall, Daniel 7 and 25, it says, and he shall speak great words against the most high, right? You know, a lot of, the, a lot of uh, Edomites are atheists, you know? But uh, more specifically, they think that they are uh, the most high, you know? Um, it says, and shall so wear out the saints of the most high. You know, one of the ways that they're... Uh, where I note the saints is um, the 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 other camps out here, you know, G, uh, ISUPK, IUIC, you know, a lot of uh, the churches that have 501c3 charters, you know, uh, the music business. There's a lot of ways out that they're doing this, you know, and um, also um, trying to put a, a hold on to the, uh, the Internet, you know trying to um, stop this word from really getting out, but they really can't stop it, you know. But uh, it says, and so we're out the saints of the most high. One of the ways that they're going to do that, you know, also is the RFID chip, you know, which is uh, coming to America, you know, to the world, actually, but the RFID chip, you know, and if you don't accept it, you're going to get put to death. It's that simple. But it says, and to think, and think to change times, Right. The Roman Gregorian calendar, which America follows, you know, a lot of other countries don't follow this this calendar, you know. So a lot of people who follow the Friday to Saturday Sabbath, you know, this is a man made calendar, you know, the Hebrew Israelites, you know, before they came over to this land, they followed the, the new moon, you know, to count their days. You know, that's the sign that the Lord gave to us, you know, you know, um, and to and and to think to change times, you know, they that that's that's one of the things that they did, you know, the Roman Gregorian calendar, you know, like for example, um, if you follow the Friday the Sabbath, Friday the Saturday Sabbath, right? It's a leap year in this calendar. The leap year is nowhere in the scripture, you know. It says and laws. Now, it says uh, the laws, right? Now it's a it's a. The so-called white man doesn't keep any law that's inside this Bible, you know. More specifically, I'm going to go to Psalms 147 and 19, right? It says, he saw of his word unto Jacob and his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. He have not dealt so with any nation, and as for his judgments, they have not known them, you know. So the so-called white man, you know, the Lord never dealt with any other nation other than Israel. Jacob, Jacob got his name changed to Israel. Jacob is Esau's brother, you know. So as far as the, the, the knowledge, understanding, the wisdom of this Bible, they don't understand it, you know. And the Lord doesn't change, you know. He didn't come to save the whole entire world. Um, I got a quick precept.
and that's the, the the last preset that I'm gonna probably get. But um, hold on. This is Malachi chapter three and six, right? It says, "For I am the Lord; I change not. Therefore, ye sons of Jacob are not consumed." You know, the Lord never changed. You know, and it's more specifically, it says that the sons of Jacob are will not be consumed. You know, but I wanted to just show some different ways of how the so-called white man um, doesn't keep the Bible. I mean, laws that's inside the Bible. Um, and if you brothers, you know, anybody watching this, you know, you can, uh, feel free to put down some laws that they don't keep, you know, that's contradicting to the law, to, to the Bible, you know, that's the reason why a lot of people out here think that the laws is done away with, you know, because the so-called white man that brainwashed our people brought us over here, you know, beat the laws, statutes, and commandments, the ways of, up out of us, you know, and now we're believing that. We don't have to follow the laws, you know, but more specifically, right, they uh, don't grow their beard, you know, they believe that uh, homosexuality, you know, you got this Bruce, Bruce Jenner or Caitlyn Jenner, whatever he want to call himself, you know, Bruce Jenner, um, the, the gay, the, the gay people would, was to get killed. Now, more specifically, the law, statutes and commandments in the Bible are not wicked you know it's the people that are wicked you know so it's a difference these th these scriptures are a way to separate the real from the fake you know so a, a person might be like okay well yeah you, you're being judgmental right but let me get into the more uh, of how it's righteous you know america for example um you got they, they take taxes out your check you know they uh they don't pay you every day, you know. We had a system, you know, back in our our when we was in our rulership, you know. Whereas though, if we was to grow food, you know, or or, or fruit, you know, we take enough fruit for our family, but leave enough fruit so that if anybody was to walk by and they was hungry, we would be they would be able to grab the food and just be able to eat, you know. And if they was poor, they would be able to grab a banana, you know, grab some some more um some blueberries, some apples, you know what I'm saying, and go trade that for something else, you know? But America, they want to control everything, you know? It's all about control, it's all about money, even with the churches, you know? Because the so-called, uh, the, the international bankers, you know, if anybody knows anything, the banking families are what really runs this world, you know? So, at the end of the day, it's all making more money to keep the rich richer you know and that's not what our father is about you know the 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 the, the lord is going to destroy america with thermonuclear missiles you know and we're trying to tell our people you know come come into our father you know because once you come into this you know with these churches out here saying that the laws is done away with, okay, one and and, and like Creflo Dollar is a main, main main major example, saying that the the Ten Commandments was done away with. So now you can go out here and go commit adultery, you know. When you come into this truth, you know, all that stuff don't go, you know. You get kicked out of out of here, you know. And that's basically what it is, you know. We're not gonna walk with somebody that's still trying to be a nigga or follow the ways of this world, you know. It's all about doing what Yahweh by Sim Yahweh Shah wants, you know. And at the end of the day, the law don't justify you, you know. But at the, it, it, it's all about having faith in Yahweh by Sim Yahweh Shah, you know. But I'm doing this lesson to prove that the so-called white man, you know, is the devil, you know. And they don't keep no law, statute, or way, or any way whatsoever in this Bible, you know. They, they, they done ruined our people. You know, and our people love them, you know, for that's just the way it is. You know, that's Stockholm Syndrome, you know. So, in general, they, they've been destroyed our people. We, what, like 50 years off of segregation, you know. And and, and y'all still hand in hand with them. Even still to this day, they're still killing our people, you know. We're not praying to the same God as them, you know. The KKK holds this Bible, you know. <laughs> they call on the name Jesus, you know, 
So what makes you different than them? You know, you got to follow the whole entire Bible, you know, the good, the bad and the ugly. And the right, and one of the main reasons why I'm going to say this before I end this, this message, because they don't follow the ways in the, uh, the Bible, you know, the, 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 the doctrine of the rape, you know, they, the, uh, according to the so-called white man, they got ways to protect uh, so-called under women, I mean, underage women, you know, they call it statutory weight, rape or whatever, right? But if you was to go into a um, bar, you know, and you was to grab a woman or, or let's say you in the alley and you was to grab a woman, you know, that woman would call rape, you know, before you did anything to her. The, the first thing that she would say is rape. You know, you in the middle of the alley, she, you grab her up, that's called rape. You know, a lot of reason why these camps out here don't understand that is because they have that Western mentality. You know, and people want to say that times have changed, right? But then that's only times have changed in America, you know? They, they, this society is confusing, you know? Because anybody can be whatever, and it's all wickedness, you know? And people can follow whatever, you know? But when you look at them other nations, they don't they don't accept that stuff. You know, they don't accept the, the, the vaccinations and stuff like that. The, the the medicine that America gives, you know, because the Lord put all type of natural remedies out here on this planet. You know, it's a natural cure for everything, you know, but our people, we lost that, you know, not, not leaving from our father, you know. And, and the so-called white man, they eat all type of pork, you know, all type of craziness, you know. And they're not affected. They, they they can go do whatever they want, you know, because this is their kingdom. But our people are following one after them. And they're doing much more wicked than them, you know. But they just was the catalyst to make our people go off, you know, and still go off to this day, you know. So the, 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 the I'm just make this quick point, you know. These people want to say that America, you know, times have changed and um, the laws and all that stuff was done away with. Right. But then you got these other countries out here that they're not affected by that stuff. You know, these other nations and stuff like that. They're not affected by half of the stuff that America goes through. You know, them taking control. Like, it's really pointless for us to be paying for a bottle of water. Times have changed, you know, so now we got to buy, buy a bottle of water, you know. Because other people, you know, Esau, these Edomites want to make money, you know. They built this country off the blood, sweat, and tears of our people. They they killed, they stole, they robbed for this land. Well, the robbed and stole is the same thing, but they robbed, they robbed for this land, you know. And they have to pay for that, you know. So this is just, you know, uh, 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 a quick little lesson, you know, to show that the so-called white man don't keep any law. That's inside the Bible, you know, and if any of y'all um, got uh, a law or anything like that, that you see that they don't follow, you know, that's righteous, you know, because a lot of people, they going to be like, OK, and, and, and who cares what they say, but they're going to say, OK, well, uh, uh, gay people, you know, you judging, you know, but, you know, show them how uh it is the, the the laws are righteous because every law every last law in this Bible is righteous. You know these gay people need to be destroyed. You know, but every last law one of these laws is righteous. You know, so if you if you guys can help me out, you know, then I I, I really appreciate that. You know, but with that I want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yah by Shem Yahushai and the sincere Salawam to all the Akim out here that's doing and pushing the work in truth and sincerity. Salawam.